fallen asleep in the sun, would ya? No, no kidding! Today is a real scorcher! Yeah, same as always. Uh, why'd the world have to end up like this? Things have been like this for around 50 years now. Ever since man's foolishness and a succession of natural disasters. Caused this one small desert to expand farther and farther. Until it had swallowed up pretty much the entire world. humans who somehow managed to survive, well, they just kept on waging their pointless wars. Destroy that machine. Guard it at all costs. So, humanity's inane belligerence resulted in the worst possible outcome for the entire planet. Demons belong in gloomy darkness. So, what are we doing out here under the blazing sun? <laughs> they call this scorching, desolate desert Sandland. But a chance encounter is about to change this dying wasteland forever. That's right, I'm a human. I come from a neighboring town. I'm Sheriff Rao. 
I'm here today because I want to ask for you demons' help. Now, is one of your leaders willing to listen to what I have to say? A human sheriff? You've got guts showing your face around here. So, are you the demon's leader? The great King Lucifer is our leader, but he'd never meet with you himself. I'm the Fiend Prince Beelzebub. State your business. Well then, I'll get straight to the point. I'd like your assistance with my mission, searching for the Legendary Spring. Legendary? Uh, explain. I have reason to believe that it exists somewhere here in this desert. A spring? In this freaking desert? <laughs> you must have sunstroke or something. What makes you think that? Do you know a bird called the water finch? This bird feeds on small freshwater fish. And during its mating season flies north to lay eggs among the rocky cliffs there. So, thief? Hmm, it does sound familiar. But how exactly is this relevant? Because I saw a water finch flying north yesterday. This means there must be a spring with small fish to sustain these birds. somewhere in this desert, to the south of our current location. Mm. But the desert to the south of here is dangerous and wild. I doubt a lone human can make it even so far as halfway across. That's why I'm here. I would like for a powerful demon to accompany me on my journey. Let's say we somehow managed to find this spring. Do you really think that humans and demons could share its water between them? Of course. If you like, you're even free to live there yourselves, as thanks for your help. All we ask is to be allowed to take what water we need to get by. So tell me, is all this your idea? Or are you here on behalf of the king? It's my plan alone. As if that greedy tyrant cares for anyone other than himself. We must find this spring by ourselves for the people. Uh. Doesn't sound like a bad deal, but we've been doing fine stealing water for ourselves. How about it? Anybody Working with a human? Him along? But it no. served that selfish king right to have his stash stolen. Sounds a bit too dangerous, don't you think? Please accept this as a token of goodwill. One of the few game consoles to have survived these chaotic times. So cool! And with games, too! <gasps> Hold on! I'll ask my dad for permission!
Yes, I heard. Aid him. That human's plan will benefit us as well. And he seems trustworthy enough. And it gives you a chance to sharpen your skills. Y yes sir! That said... Once you return, you're only allowed to use that console for one hour a day. Be sure to only play in a bright room, and don't sit too close to the screen. Um... Uh, fear's fear!